What's going on guys? Hope you are having a good day today. We are back for day seven of our 100 day challenge in Pineville. Yesterday we cleared out the school. Today we're going to stick to the plan. We're going to start working on these nice houses. We want to get all of these right here. Look at We have seen all of these houses here and all of these structures over here. I know my camera's set up so like I'm over, I'm over down here in this corner and some people might think there's a mini map. There's no mini map on Sandbox or on Apocalypse. I don't like the mini map. It's cool, but I just don't like playing with it. And Sandbox doesn't do it. So there's no mini map to look at. Start by checking the backyard. We busted out the generator. I've heard. I watch people that play um, Project Zomboid. Do Project Zomboid. I subscribe to all your channels. If I've come across your channel, you do Project Zomboid. I've subbed to it because I love the game. But I've also I've heard so many people say that generators don't spawn in garages that are attached to houses. Clearly that's not accurate. I've seen plenty of times where generators have spawned in garages that are attached to houses. So. Fake news. Hey, we're prepared. stuff. Fireplace is cool. I like fireplaces. Let's go upstairs, see what we got. One of the mods I like to run is um, Stairway. Oh gosh, what's it called? I'm blanking on what the mob's called now, but if you hit uh, E while you're on it, I think it's. You can get warned if there are zomboids up top, but it's not 100% reliable. Sometimes I run with it, sometimes I don't, but usually what I do is I'll run up the stairs. If you're ever worried about something, just run. That's, that's one of the times that I do advise to run in this game. If you want to run, run. And if you're um, concerned about, oh, that's really tore up. Okay, let's um, use this one up. We'll put that one back on our back. But if you want to run, run. Other than that, try to reserve your energy. But if you think it's going to be something sketchy or you're not sure, you think there might be some voids in the area, run. So at least you can knock them out of the way or something. Ooh, 
or just, you know, whisper. There's things, you know, you can do. But sometimes, just... If you whisper, you kind of give them a heads up. If it's just one, you run upstairs, you can get the jump on it. If it's just one or two, you can get the jump on them. But if you whisper or say something, and that alerts them and they start heading toward the stairs, that's, that's not good. That's not what you want. Alright, let's swap sides. I want to see if we can find a key for this. Isn't that nice? Those cars are fun. Do we have gas? Empty gas can. We'll sign in some gas from the truck. Did we just blow a tire? Okay. It sounded weird. Yeah, if you do Project Zomboid content, you, you post stuff to YouTube, let me know. I'll come subscribe to your channel. I'm cool with that. I like to support people who like to support this game. I like little indie developers. I don't mind the big conglomerate, you know, the, the big AAA game studios. But let's... I prefer to find nice indie games. That's the only thing about having, living the hobo life. You don't really have a. We'll, we'll, we'll do the. We'll do the school part. There's this truck we have the keys for. This car we have the keys for. So no gas. Gas. Maybe we should put a little bit of gas in the truck. Why did I fill the freaking? Man. When we get done searching these houses, we'll go gas the truck back up and I'll put some gas.
starting to get a little weary of grabbing smokes. Loot this crate. For, no, we got we got a cake. Fruit cake. There's so much food in Pineville. Fun little map. So far, so. I think we made enough noise if there were zomboids that would have came down. Bag upgrades, nice. Nice houses, man. It's always wonderful. I found it. Ooh, let me check. We are so terrible on ammo. I'm gonna see if any of these have any ammo. We're gonna, if they have ammo, we're gonna take the ammo out of them. Eat that peach too. How is our weight going? It's going down. That's what we want. Really need that to drop down like eight, nine pounds.
check the backyard for any problems. Another one in here somewhere. We're just gonna let them bust that door down. Fitness contraption would be cool if it wasn't a hundred day challenge. A 1022. It's an old school one with the walnut stock, uh, metal bands. I like it. It's definitely a lot heavier. I, I get why the uh, more modern ones look more popular with people. They're a lot lighter. That's gonna be it though. I think if, if there were any more, they would have uh, been acting up too. But we're still gonna be cautious. Ooh. Man, we got us some 9mm now. I just want to see what's in the kitchen, just out of curiosity. I doubt we're going to take anything from it. Yeah, we're not going to do anything with it. Alright, we'll, we'll 
we'll search out the garage and then we are out of here. Maybe we should take that welder. I think it's the first one that we've that we've come across. Plenty of propane land around. Let's eat the beach. And let's actually equip that in both hands. We're gonna throw this magazine in. the rest of that cake just so I can put the cake pan in the truck. Cooking sheet. Cooking pan. Right. Drink bleach. Ripperonis. Exactly what I was hoping for. Oh, we found out good. So now we got two magazines. We had two M14s. Neither one of them has any attachments to it. We'll grab one of these. Then we'll leave the other. get a couple <clears throat> we get a couple boxes of 12 gauge we're gonna work on aiming For, I'm looking forward to patch. I'm looking forward to, to build 42, and I'm looking forward to GTA 6. Those are the two things that I'm most looking forward to coming up. What about you? What 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 are you looking forward to game wise? Look at this! Look at this! That's a couple boxes of shotguns. So that's exactly what we want. I think once we get done searching these nice houses. 
Well, it's gonna be pretty late. To start off week two, we're gonna we're gonna shoot. We're gonna go into like downtown and just start popping off. See what we see what we uh, attract. Backyard. Get it, I kind of don't want to get it. I don't think we're going to get it. Not right now. Two, three, that gun case back on the shelf. Let's check the kitchen. And we'll check upstairs. Get to the last nice house. So we're getting our helicopter again. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna say hello to the helicopter. Hi, helicopter guy. Let's go downtown. Let's get the shotgun first. still have this house right here to look at, but we're going to take advantage of the helicopter situation. And boom. Absolutely brutal awesome zombies. Bring all of them on. Oh, 
helicopter. No helicopter. Oh, maybe the helicopter went to go get some wood. Bring them back. Bring them back. Bring them all. All of them. Bring the entire city of Pineville to me. Where'd the helicopter go? We're gonna have to go find that helicopter. Did I really just mess with two shotgun shells on a group like that? No way! How is that possible? Alright, we're gonna have to pop open the boxes. Shotgun blast that didn't drop a single one. That ain't right. I 
that was it of the helicopter? Lame. Yeah, we're definitely, we, we, we have population high, but we're gonna have to keep it very high for the next run. not a lot of zomboids. I still have so much more ammo. I think the helicopter went that way. Let's go hop in the truck and see. Well, it is 12, it is 2040, so it is 840, almost nine o'clock. Hmm. Maybe we should, uh... So ripped off by that helicopter, dude. Just grab this one down here, we don't the door. There's just a part of me that just can't leave a zomboid alone. If I see a zomboid, I just want to. Smash the zombie. Go. Come on, man. Just hopping over a little fence. I mean, I get you're a little overloaded, but. Such a drama queen. Oh, that's right, we haven't done the nice house before. We was gonna do the nice house and then do this block. Hmm. Hmm. We're gonna stick with it. We're gonna do the last nice house. Sticking to the plan, man. Maybe we'll get another helicopter. Because that one was just like... I mean, even if there's a house alarm now, we're not going to really draw many toward us. Ooh, propane torch. Need that. Okay, so now we have everything we... Ooh, yeah, there's some trap. But we have everything we need to do metalworking if we need to do metalworking. Which I don't think we're going to need to do metalworking. I don't see why we would. Now 400 day challenge. 100 day challenge just to clear this city and secure it. I like it. We're taking it. I haven't shot a Tech 9 in a long time. That was actually one of the first guns I shot with a Tech 9.
crowbar. It's crap condition. M625 in crap condition. We will take that 45 auto though. Give us that. Keep the gun. Herbalist is a good one to read. I. Ooh. Nice. It's already getting pretty dark on us. But we just got to finish. Do we need this magazine? I already read it. Nope. Okay, let's get out of here. Sweet home for the night. Stayed in that one last night. Stayed in this one tonight. We will wait till we'll call it here. I thought I had books on me. I was just gonna read until six, but I do not have any we'll have herbalist on me. But we'll call it here. We'll read a herbalist. We'll start back in the morning. The sun will be up by the time we get going good. And <clears throat> kind of the helicopter helped us out kind of getting us ahead of schedule. We kind of pulled all the zombies in the area. So I'm thinking... Alright, so this is what I'm doing. 
we will look at these two places search these out and then we are going to look for the police station we'll try to find the police station after that clear around the police station see what kind of ammo we can pull from there and then we're going to kind of know our ammo situation there's still i'm sure plenty of ammo to find in this town but that's going to be the next big spot for ammo we've we've looked at the nice houses maybe these are nice houses too and then maybe these down over here those are like, those are they got garages so these are probably nice houses as well so there's probably still plenty of good ammo We'll find the police station, see if we can find the hardware station. We find those, locate those, we're pretty golden. Um, and then we're going to really start going through the town. We're going to pop off, try to bring as many zomboids as we can out, destroy them. And that should make it a little easier for us to wrap up this town. We, we might actually turn this into a 30-day challenge. <laughs> We might actually be able to clear this town in 30 days and secure it. Maybe not. But I don't know. We'll see. Week one went very well. We survived week one. Got our helicopter event taken care of. Got plenty of zomboids taken care of. How many have we killed so far? Only 541. Wonk, wonk. We're definitely going to not have high zomboid population next time. We're going to go very high. Yeah. But anyway, you guys are awesome. If you made it to the end of this video, please subscribe and like. It would help the channel out very much. I would greatly appreciate it. And I hope you have a great day, guys.